Okay, it seems like the resolution is very badly fucked up. Okay, it's downloading a device driver probably for the CPU. I'm not too sure. Could be, might not be. We shall find out. But yeah, the hard drive's going mad right now, which has slowed down the whole PC. So we'll find out, guys, what's going on. Mm. Let's click for status. Unidentified device. Ah, oh, that might be the CPU. I really hope it's not, because then it, would, it means it can't recognize the device. But how the fuck did it boot up? I don't know. We'll find out. Never mind, guys. He has found the CPU. i7, i5, 7 gigs of RAM. So I don't know what the hell is he installing. But I need to sort this resolution out. It's annoying me. Oh my goodness. I want to open up CPU-Z. We'll have a look there. I want to see if it's... I might have knocked my graphics card out or something. I have no idea. We shall see, guys. Ah, we fucked up the graphics card somehow. As you can see. No graphics. So that's why... That's why it was slow at the start for some reason. Okay, so we've got four cores, four threads, eight MB, bloody hell. All that work and the graphics card's dead. I don't know. Alright guys, I'm gonna restart it anyway. Our first thing I'm gonna do is restart it. If that don't work, I'm gonna... Oh! It's done. Ah, yes, it's found it. It was just a driver that was missing. So when the new CPU was put in, you needed to get a new driver. We start the PC now. Hopefully it's fixed it. So there isn't an issue. I've not done anything wrong with it. It's just how it was. So hopefully it's fixed it. And yeah, we shall find out. <laughs> yes, I think it's back because the Windows sign small. Starting Windows small. Yahoo. Okay, so the graphics is back, I think. Hopefully. We shall find out. If it is, then we'll continue with the benchmarks and and I'll show you how powerful the CPU is. Woohoo! Uh, games should be a much higher FPS now, like 20 FPS gain, because it's quite a big upgrade. You lo you gain, you're losing two uh, hyper-threading cores, but you gain physical cores, which is more powerful, two more powerful. Uh, Actually, you're not losing any, are you? Okay. We are in. But the resolution's fucked up again. So I need to sort out the resolution. It's stretched out now. And the colors are going to be weird. Guys, as you can see, CPU is very low freak uh, usage. Zero, zero. It goes back down to zero. It's very good. So that's when you know that you got a good CPU. Uh, Intel Atom, which is one of the worst CPUs I've ever had in my life. CPU usage is 100% on idle like literally just waiting here it'll be a hundred percent that's why the shit so i suggest you stay away from intel atoms i guess we're gonna sort out my cooler settings and stuff it's gonna be weird i don't know why geforce experience okay guys so it's picked up that i have a gt 1030 so that's okay yeah, driver version. So what it's done, the reason I feel like it stretched it because it has, because this is a 1080p display, it's gone to 1200 pixels, which wasn't what it was before. So I need to sort that out. And the color's gone as well, so I need to sort that out as well. But yeah, apart from that, everything's great. Okay guys, we've finally fixed it. And it's nice and up and running. So yeah, I'm gonna Install these updates quickly because it's eating my hard drive and that's going to affect the performance. Can you see how the hard drive is full? Like constant in use. That's going to affect performance when I do the benchmark. So I'm just going to let them update, restart the computer when it's done, and then I'll do the benchmarks.